say what's up everybody if you've seen Chris Titus Tech's video on how to bypass paywalls it is a year old I'm gonna show you the better way to bypass paywalls and the latest way to do it so it's, it's gonna be the same idea we're gonna be using an extension however it's gonna be a, a brand new extension that is currently still being updated uh, Chris Titus in his video he shows this um, extension right here it is hosted on uh, github it's called bypass paywalls and when we go to it let me turn off uh, dark mode right here so we can, can see it better so as you can see uh, this is the link that Chris Titus shows this is the extension as you can see right here uh, for Chrome the last time it was updated was October 20th um, the Firefox version the last time it was updated was 2020 alright so we're not going to be using this one on github but we're going to be using a similar extension that call is from uh, Magnolia1234 that's the developer and it's hosted on GitLab GitLab is similar to github okay it's for uh, open source projects for developers to host their open source projects so what you do is just go to google type in a GitLab bypass paywall alright and it should be uh, the, the, like I said the, Git, the GitLab link so uh, you can go to any of them right I'm gonna go to the Chrome one or you can go to the Firefox one doesn't matter depending on which browsers you use so um, let me just go here to the official link so yeah um, the Chrome version will work on any Chromium based browsers uh, like Edge Microsoft Edge, Windows Edge, uh, Brave, and any, of course, Chrome OS, uh, sorry, not Chrome OS, Chrome browser, uh, any Chromium based browser, this version will work on. Even though you shouldn't be using Chrome, you shouldn't be using any Chromium browsers for reasons that I'm not going to mention in this video. So I use Firefox based browser, so for me, it's this one right here. Okay? GitLab. Magnolia one two three four, bypass paywalls Firefox clean. Okay, now once you're here, it's gonna look like this. You can read through the page, all this information, right? You can read through it. However, just for the sake of this video, I'm just gonna go down here, click on installation. It's gonna take me to the installation section. Let me make this large for you guys can see. So it says you can install the add-on from the GitLab releases. All right, download the XPI dash file from latest release so go to download and install the add-on or drag it from your file manager anywhere on a page tab in Firefox so we're gonna go to GitLab releases and as you can see the current release as of making this video is version 3.4.7.0 and the last time it was released sorry the last it was released six days ago right so the last time it was updated was six days ago right this is way better than you know 2020 and you know uh, that old extension that Chris Titus showed. Now what we need to do here is we gotta click on bypass paywalls dash clean. So sorry, bypass underscore paywalls underscore clean the XPI file. All right. So it's not the custom one; it's just the uh, 3740 version dot XPI. So you click on that, you download it. Now, once you download it, just go to your add-ons. Depending on which browser you use, I use Firefox, like I said, a Firefox-based browser. Mozilla, yeah. So we click on the cogwheel right here. All right. Install add-on from file, and then you just pick the file that we just downloaded, which is the bypass paywalls clean version number .xpi and then it's gonna give you this uh, prompt right here alright just add and there we go bypass paywalls clean has been added now let me um, do this right here real quick I'm gonna pin it to the toolbar we click on it and then we can go to the 
options. Let me turn off. Oh, you can, I guess, it's dark mode. So, there we go. This is the options for it, and look at all these sites. By default, it is. All these sites have been enabled for bypassing. Even general paywall scripts. Alright? There we go, guys. We've installed bypass paywalls updated version always being updated version hope you guys found this video helpful take care everyone peace